What is going on guys? This is Ben here. It is really late in the morning and we are trying to get 12 wins with the Battle Ram Challenge. We're on the Grand Battle Ram Challenge. We have 10 wins right now, one loss. The deck that I'm using is the Battle Ram, of course, the Electro Wizard. The Electro Wizard is like the, the complete stop to the Battle Ram. The Zep for Skeleton Army, Skeleton Army, the Prince, and then the, uh, the Tombstone because it is very good against Giants and it's good at dragging in the, just pretty much dragging in everything. And then the Mini Pack is for Giant and then the Executioner because Executioner is an amazing card. So we're at 10 wins. I'm going to do the two live battles here. So hopefully we can go two and two. We do, some for, we do have some free chests. Uh, but if I get this, I'm pretty sure it's going to be the world's first on YouTube for getting the uh, the Battle Ram Challenge. So, because it's like, the, the challenge literally came out not too long ago, and I woke up to try it out. So, and this is my first run through it, so we'll see what we can do. And I'm going to be sitting down, and I'm playing on my phone. That's how I normally play. So, let's get into it. If I don't talk much, it's because it's hardcore concentration, man. Alright, let's get it. Take some deep breaths, and we'll see what we want to do. I'm not gonna drop first. I'll just tell you that right now. We're just gonna wait it out. Um, I guess we'll drop the Electro Wizard. I don't have a whole lot to actually drop versus the Executioner going to drop first. So we did get quite a bit of value out of that, which does suck. And where is my Zap, man? Will our Prince get a hit? Yes, that's big for us right there. Any tower damage you can take, and I'm actually going to take out this minion because I might push with the Battle Ram here. Which we are going to do since we have a pretty good push. Okay, he's running the Golem. Uh, We're probably going to take his tower. Which is good. Almost took his tower. We got the Skarmy for the Skeleton Army. He's going for he's going ham for a push, man. Holy crap. He went all in on that one, and if he pretty much He lost a lot of elixir, a lot of elixir on that one. So I have a huge advantage. Uh, this is my first golem matchup, honestly. It's this is gonna be interesting. We know he has the lightning spell. Nice, the Electric Wizard did get a little bit of chip damage in there. We'll drop the tombstone in the back, even if he may lightning spell. And I'm going to take care of this executioner with the mini P.E.K.K.A. I'm pretty sure he's, I'm pretty confident he's going to lightning spell this executioner here. But it's fine, he's not going to get a lot of, he's not going to get the tombstone in there as well. Elixir Collector, we're going to push on that. We got to go for a tower here. It's fine that he used that. It's it, I'm, I'm feeling we're going to take his tower because we're going to kill his mini P.E.K.K.A. I'm sitting on 10 elixir here. Oh, okay, we did act actually kill the tower. Which is unfortunate, but I don't think he has much to stop. Oh, God. His uh, executioner got a lot of value there. So much stuff going down. We're gonna have to go all in. We didn't quite get it. We're gonna get lightning spell. Dang it, man. That was so close. I couldn't get that tower damage. I should have cycled through my zap to hit it. Okay, well that sucks. So now we gotta win out here. We gotta win two in a row. That was my first matchup versus the Golem. We'll say I, I wasn't a fan of that. It was it was rough. Tombstone does help out a little bit. And like I say, we're just gonna we're gonna wait. I, I, I don't want to lose this man. 10 in a row? Are you serious? Another golem? That's so lame, dude. Two in a row? I did miss one of the skeleton armies. Hopefully we get a prince hit. Which we did. Oh 
Musketeer, we're gonna skeleton army there. He does have the zap. We'll take the tower damage. Um, we... Okay, he's gonna do that. We're actually gonna push the right hand side. That time we got all of them. We should get a good tower damage there. Nice, nice. Evened it out. Would have been nice if our mini P.E.K.K.A would have got a hit there on that Musketeer, which was not the case. Okay, so we are going to have to deal with the Golem. Battle Ram is ready for whenever he drops it. So he's pushing the other side, actually. And I don't think he can stop our Battle Ram, so we're probably going to take the tower. Dang, not quite. We're so close. Is that barb gonna clutch up? Yes, it did. Okay, that might be huge for us. Ooh, elite barbarians. We're actually gonna stop those way back there. Okay, he opted not to skeleton or zap those, so thank god we stopped them way back there. We're actually gonna throw it on the tombstone. Drop the I didn't really need to drop that electro wizard there, kinda panic drop that one. Prince, just to just to push, wasted my zap, but whatever. We want this. We want that gone. Okay, never mind. Didn't even kill it. That's unfortunate. Can we stop this 18-second push? I sure hope so. He's gonna zap. We're gonna zap. Two. One. Yes. That was so clutch. We were about to lose that tower. Whew. My god, dude. That was intense. Oh my goodness. So, I'm trying to keep it down a little bit because there's people sleeping <laughs> in the other ways. Oh my god. So, we're up to 11 wins. Can we clutch up here? It's do or die right now. If we lose, we don't get the 12 wins. If we do win, we get the 12 wins. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little nervous. If we go up against... Golem is such a hard matchup, man. I hope we don't go up against another one. If he pumps up, though, we're gonna do Della split push on each side. Um... Interesting... Uh, okay. A mini peck of that. No, I'll actually push with the Prince. Cause now we have our zap up. He's gonna have to take care of the mini P.E.K.K.A. Okay. I dropped that. I missed drop that, but that elite barbarian hopefully doesn't kill it. Yes. Okay. Mm. Wasn't the best. I don't want to push with the. Battle Ram just yet. I want to get my elixir back. Feeling that tombstone dropping, which is fine. That hog is going to be the difference maker. Oh, that was that was that was a bad call by him. Okay, so we almost took that tower. I'm glad I zapped when I did. I'm feeling elite barbarians getting dropped trying to push my tower. Or not. Okay, that's fine. We're just going to chill back and play some defense, because I know he's going to try and push us eventually. We, we have a good lead, and I have a good counter to most of his stuff. We're going to try and catch him with his pants down here. I don't think I've ever said that in my life before. And it worked, because that will take out our tower. 
Nice. Dude, this is intense, man. Holy crap. Come on. Can we clutch up? 30 seconds left. I just do not have to... I cannot... I'm not gonna swear here. I was gonna say something. Crap the bed, we'll just say. That almost hit our tower. We do have the scale Oh, the tombstone is key. It basically stops a lot of things right now. It's like the note. We'll just drop it right in the middle so we can't push. We almost got the two crown. I'm just dropping stuff just because we can now. Can we get the two crown to finish it off? So close. Let's go, man. I'm so pumped. I'm trying to contain myself. That wasn't as bad as it was. We'll hit him with the GG on that one. World's first, 12 win on YouTube. Grand challenge, screenshot in that. Battle Ram, yes, we had two losses. Golem is a very tough match. Super intense. Okay, let's get it. This is my first unlocking of the Battle Ram, so we're gonna get 50 for winning the Grand Challenge. And this is the first run at it, too. I still have my free entry on the other one as well. Coblin Barrel. Giant. Dude, I'm so happy. You guys have no idea what. Ooh, I unlocked the Battle Ram there and uh, kind of passed it. We did Legendary? So we did not get our Legendary. I passed our Battle Rams, but we did get uh, 50 of them. So now we have it unlocked. New card. I'm, I'm pumped, man. Ooh, and then released in 20 days is that Goblin Gang. So we'll talk about the Goblin Gang. The Goblin Gang is probably going to be a game changer. Like, drop, spawn six goblins, three with knives, three with spears. So three spear goblins, three normal goblins. For, excuse me there. For three elixir. So <laughs> that's going to be super key. Yes, the executioner is probably going to destroy it. But it's going to be probably be like the end to regular goblins. Because it's only one elixir more. So the Goblin Gang... I am so excited for I cannot wait for it. But guys, shout out for, uh, or not shout out, but subscribe to the channel for Clash Royale content because it's coming fast, it's coming hard, and uh, that doesn't really make sense there. But yeah, I'm just posting a lot of Clash Royale is what I'm trying to say. The battle deck, I don't, I don't have it right now, but it's it's wonders, and I don't even know what I'm saying at this point. I'm freaking tired, so I'm going to bed. I got my 12 wins, dude. Let's go. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and uh, let's check the profile how many cards I actually won before I... Before I leave here, that's only my second 12 win challenge, by the way. But we have 9,165 cards, so hope you guys enjoyed it though. Make sure to like you did. Let me know how your challenge is going, and at least try and unlock the one cards you can get in your other chest for the battle room. It's an interesting card, but hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys later.